गुड मॉर्निंग एंड वेलकम टू ऑल बी एस सी फर्स्ट ईयर स्टूडेंट्स ऑफ फिजिक्स साइंस इन सेमिस्टर सेकेंड वी हैव सीन द फर्स्ट यूनिट सीड कलेक्शन एंड इन सेकेंड यूनिट वी हैव स्टार्टेड आर्टिफिशियल फर्टिलाइजेशन बाय स्ट्रिपिंग मेथड इन दिस आर्टिफिशियल फर्टिलाइजेशन बाय स्ट्रिपिंग मेथड वी हैव सीन फर्स्ट पार्ट हाउ द फिश दीज आर टू बी कैप्चर्ड देन दिस आर्टिफिशियल फर्टिलाइजेशन दीज आर टू बी हाउ मिनिमाइज द प्रॉब्लम विच इज टू बी ऑफर दोज प्रॉब्लम विच इज टू बी फाउंड इन द नेचुरल सीड कलेक्शन दीज प्रॉब्लम दीज आर टू बी ओवरकम दीज प्रॉब्लम दीज आर टू बी मिनिमाइजिंग लोअरिंग फ्रॉम द आर्टिफिशियल फर्टिलाइजेशन एंड डिजायर्ड क्वालिटी एंड रिक्वायर्ड क्वान्टिटी ऑफ सीड दीज आर टू प्रोड्यूस विद द हेल्प ऑफ द आर्टिफिशियल फर्टिलाइजेशन एंड दिस आर्टिफिशियल फर्टिलाइजेशन इन दिस पार्ट इन लास्ट पार्ट वी हैव सी दैट टू टाइप्स ऑफ फर्टिलाइजेशन बाय स्ट्रिपिंग मेथड वन इज द ड्राई स्ट्रिपिंग मेथड एंड सेकेंड इज द वेट स्ट्रिपिंग मेथड हियर वी हैव सी दैट हाउ दीज टू मेथड दीज आर टू बी इनकॉर्पोरेटेड टू ईच अदर एंड हाउ दीज टू मेथड दीज आर टू बी इम्पॉर्टेंट टू प्रोड्यूस द रिक्वायर्ड क्वान्टिटी ऑफ फिश सीड विद इन शॉर्ट पीरियड विद द हेल्प ऑफ द स्ट्रिपिंग मेथड फॉर दैट पर्पज द फिशरमैन हैव ए नॉलेज अबाउट टू स्ट्रिप एंड टू कैच द फिश इन प्रॉपर पोजिशन एंड प्रॉपर वे एंड देन इट इज टू बी परफॉर्म दिस टेक्निक ए वेरी इजीएस टेक्निक इट इज टू बी यूज फॉर द आर्टिफिशियल फर्टिलाइजेशन दिस टेक्निक दीज आर टू बी सीन ड्राई मेथड इज जनरली प्रिफर्ड एंड इट इज बिलीव्ड दैट ड्राई मेथड इज जनरली प्रिफर्ड एंड इट इज बिलीव्ड दैट द मिल्ट रिमेन फर्टाइल फॉर ए लॉन्गर पीरियड ऑफ टाइम when dry dry method is generally preferred that it is believed that the milt or the sperms or the spermatozoa what is meant by milt milt is nothing but the sperms or the spermatozoa of male fish this milt or the spermatozoa or the sperms these are to be remain fertile for longer period for longer time when these are to be in dry condition as compared to wet condition वेट मेथड इज मोर सुटेड टू द एग्स दैट आर स्टिकी वन मेथड इज टू बी सुटेड टू द स्पर्म दैट इज ड्राई मेथड इन दिस ड्राई मेथड स्पर्म दीज आर टू बी फाइबल स्पर्म दीज आर टू बी फर्टाइल फॉर लॉन्ग टाइम फॉर लॉन्ग पीरियड बट इन वेट मेथड इट इज टू बी सुटेड वेट मेथड दीज आर टू बी सुटेबल गुड फॉर द एग्स बिकॉज एग्स आर टू बी मोर सुटेड एग्स दीज आर टू बी स्टिकी एंड इन दिस स्टिकी एग्स this water these are to be present then these are to be more suited the female is caught and dried female is caught and dried with the help of towel with the help of towel or paper napkin the fish is held with one hand and it is stripping is done with the thumb of other hand or better way female is caught clean it or dry it with the help of paper napkin with the help of sponge towel after drying it the fish is to be keep held in left hand keep in left hand and with the help of right hand thumb with the help of right hand thumb pressure these are to be gently applied on the abdomen of the female fish from just behind to the operculum up to the faint region up to the opening of the genital opening the eggs are forced out with the gentle massaging gentle mass eggs are forced out with the gentle massaging the abdomen and eggs are collected in enamel or plastic trays the abdomen and eggs massaging the abdomen and eggs are collected the eggs are forced out with the gentle massaging the abdomen and eggs are collected in that is enamel or plastic tray or
The eggs are forced out with the gentle messaging. The abdomen and eggs are collected in enamel or plastic trays or it is to be called containers or the watch glass or the that is glass pots or trips. Stripping of male fish is carried out in similar manner and milt is collected. Stripping of male fish is carried out in similar manner and milt is collected. The gametes are then mixed as soon as possible by means of a quill feather to allow fertilization. Stripping of male fish is carried out in similar manner and milt is collected. The gametes are then mixed as soon as possible by means of a quill feather or to allow the fertilization. To allow the fertilization. The fertilized eggs are then washed a few times with clean water. Fertilized eggs is to be washed few times with clean water to remove excess milk and allow to stay undisturbed and allow to stay undisturbed in fresh water for about 30 minutes. For about 30 minutes those fertilized eggs are then washed a few times with clean water, dry water, clean or a cold water, not dry, clean and cold water to remove excess milk and allow to stay undisturbed in fresh water for about 30 minutes. The eggs are then ready to release into the hatching tanks. The eggs are ready for release into the hatching tanks and in this hatching tank egg these are to be ready for hatching purpose. Egg these are to be ready for the hatching condition. See the fish in left hand the fish is to be keep the fish is to be clean with a towel with sponge and keep in a such position that it is to be do not fall down it is to be do not fall down and damage that's why it is to be in such position and with the help of right hand thumb pressure is to be applied from just behind to the upper column in this direction pressure these are to be applied in the abdomen in the belly region and from this belly region those eggs the ovary these <coughs> ovary and wall these are to be ruptured broken down and egg these are to be released into the containers are this watch glass and after completely removing the eggs fish is to be keep again alive from those sources from those areas fishes these are to be collected fishes these are to be select in that part in that pond or that water the, this fish these are to be released this fish these are to be removed and this is the simple method this is the simple technique only in this technique adding water weight stripping Without adding water, that is the dry stick. The female fish is caught and dried with the help of a towel. The fish is held with the left hand and its belly turned upwards. And stripping is done with the help of the thumb of right hand. The eggs are forced out by gently massaging the abdomen starting from the hinder end of the upper column or just from the belly region. At the end of stripping, the abdomen appears entirely empty. At the end of stripping, the abdomen appears entirely empty and collapse and all the eggs have passed out into the container or in the watch glass or in bowl. There is no ill effect. There is no ill effect. This is ill. I double L. I double L. Ill means other yes. There is no ill effect on the fish which is set free. Jeva kema to me fish male and both male and female fish we can take. At that time fish is to be healthy, free and active. Fish is to be healthy, free and active. These are to be not ill effect. Means to other yes. It show a abnormal behavior. It not show a abnormal behavior. Then abnormal behavior. Abnormal behavior as as as. Then a male is caught and kept the belly upward. The milt had a uh, milt had eggs are thoroughly mixed. It is again not had na had. It is a had H A D. Had eggs, the milt had eggs are thoroughly mixed with the help of feather. Water is added. The eggs are mixed again by stripping and stirring. It is called as wet stripping. And when these eggs only these are to be stirred with the help of spermatophores or the milts 
without adding water it is called as dry stripping dry stripping is suited for sperms and wet stripping is suited for eggs after some time or after 30 minutes to 45 minutes fertilized eggs are transferred to hatching pits fertilized eggs are transferred to hatching pits many fish species can be artificially spawned many fish species can be artificially spawned and fertilized eggs are obtained on a large number by the this stripping method or by this above method means these artificial fertilization by stripping with dry stripping at wet stream after some time the fertilized eggs are transferred to the hatching pits many fish fish species can be artificially spawned whenever we can require desired quality and required quantity of seed such mature or such breeders these are to be collect and these breeders these are to be gently applying pressure by artificial fertilization we can perform this technique and we can use this method and the artificial fertilization is to be done with the help of apo method apo method on large scale spawn and fry is produced with the help of apo method on large scale spawn and fry is produced but this method is not suitable on large scale because sometime physical injury is occur on large scale for more than 2 crores more than 20 lakh more than 35 lakh yet these are to be required at that time this method is to be not suitable this method is to be not efficient with the help of apo method on large scale spawn and fry is produced but this method is not suitable on large scale because sometimes physical injury is occur and when such injury is found then fish is not healthy in condition with the help of apo method on large scale spawn and fry is produced but this method is not suitable on large scale because sometimes physical injury is occur and when such injury is found then fish is not healthy in condition and when fish is not healthy in condition the x which is to be maximum x or mortality internal sometimes internal organs are to be damaged and when internal organs these are to be damaged x or mortality then fertilization is to be collapse fertilization is to be not occur properly that's why due to this method small scale seed production is to be done but for the large quantities such as 10 lakh 25 lakh 35 lakh or more than 1 crore 2 crore seed these are to produce at that time these eggs or this method these are to be not suited this method is to be not proper applicable internal organs sometime damage on when pressing the abdomen or thumb on the abdomen and fishes are ill condition and show abnormal behavior when fishes show abnormal behavior ill condition these are to be occur fish is to be sometime fish is to be mortal mortality is to be occur due to the pressing of the thumb and when fish is to or more time is to be taken for egg removing that time fish is also mortality and when fish is to be mortality large scale then this method these are to be a disadvantages not advantages and that's why this method is to be not suited but in small scale eggs are production or spawn production is to be done which is to be desired quality and required quantity of seed is to be produced with the help of this method and hence this artificial fertilization by stripping is another source another choice for the quality of seed and quantity of seed is to be produced on a inland as well as the sea water fish culture hence this method is to be adopted this method is used to be suited hope you are understood this artificial fertilization by stripping method that is dry stripping and wet stick stripping simple dry stripping without adding water no water these are to be added and wet stripping when water these are to be added and both sperms and ova or the egg these are to be thoroughly mixed after 6 to 8 hours these egg these are to be fertilized then the eggs these are to be fertilized after 3 to 5 days spawns these are to be produced from these eggs and these spawn these are to be act as a seed for the future culture hence this method is to be use this method is to be adopted with this we have completed artificial fertilization by stripping method any problem any difficulty please ask 
थैंक यू ऑल ऑफ यू